Hi guys, today's recipe is a very simple stir fry and the idea with this one is to avoid any type of allergen in the diet, uh, load up with plenty of vegetables to boost your immune system and have a relatively fatty meat to get you full and keep your blood sugar stable. So let's get started. We're going to start by chopping our vegetables, which include broccoli, mushrooms, onions, carrots, and garlic. But that doesn't mean you can't add something if you want to or omit something if it bothers you. Once you've got everything chopped up, go ahead and get it all together and take your skillet preheated to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. What I like to do is go ahead and add the ground beef and before it really starts cooking, add the onions, the garlic, and also the mushrooms. These vegetables are going to absorb some of the fat and the flavor from the beef, which is nice because we're not using any seasonings here. Now we're going to add two teaspoons of salt, and one teaspoon of black pepper. After the salt and pepper are added, just cook everything until the beef is cooked all the way through. I've sped this up, but it'll probably take five or 10 minutes. The next step is to place the broccoli and the carrots into the skillet, but do not stir them in as you did with the other vegetables. Place the lid onto the skillet and make a good seal. Leave it there for between 3 and 5 minutes so the broccoli and carrots steam but are still slightly crunchy. Okay, after you've let the broccoli and carrots steam, you're ready to serve. I like to eat it on a bed of brown rice, but you can use quinoa or if you're avoiding grains, you can eat it by itself. Okay, here you can see how much I've got left after already having a plate. I'm going to be able to fill up both of these glass containers and still have a little bit left in the skillet. So you can see this recipe makes a lot of food. <laughs> 